Welcome back to Maple Motors, guys. Today we're going for a test drive and a 1970 Challenger convertible. This one's got the 318 under the hood. Nice running car. We're gonna take it down the road and see how she drives. I did a walk around video yesterday. I'll link the two together today and uh, you'll know everything about this car before you come down here. Go ahead and check out maplemotors.com for financing and shipping information. Plus you can see all of our inventory. And also hit that subscribe button. If you wanna see cars like this every single day, you can hit that notification bell and then you'll see them. All right guys, it's that time. Let's go for a ride. Gonna look around the interior before we take off. Go ahead and place your bets. If you haven't seen the walk around video, do you think the horn works on this one? Showing 14,000 miles on the dash. It's hard to stand behind that in a 70 model. Um, before we take off, we're gonna be dropping the top and letting some of the heat out. Go ahead and start her up. Starts up nice and easy. The gas gauge is coming up. Uh, alternator's coming up as well. I'm sure the temp works. We'll check that out as we ride. Go ahead, drop this top. All right, guys, here we go. Well, let me grab the boot back here before I mess the boot up. There we go, all right. I went ahead and got half the boot on. It just clips on nice and easy. All the clips are there. But I gotta have two hands to do it. You just slide that on there and it clips on. Go ahead, get buckled, getting ready to take off down the road. Looks like the temperature gauge is coming up now. Goes into gear good. We haven't tried to horn yet, y'all ready? Horn does work on this one. Some wind blowing, it's humid. It's all good out here in Tennessee, so. Speedometer is coming up on the dash. And I got some traffic coming up on me. I gotta let this truck get out of the way. doesn't look too bad I'd say it's at least a 20 to 25 year paint job that's been on here it's got its spots but I mean it's an older paint job turn signals are popping up on the dash Nice and smooth. 
good. I'm gonna pull in this parking lot right here. Go ahead and get some outside shots. If you haven't before seen any of my gear, you can look below in the description. I usually put uh, everything that I use from this tripod to the GoPro 7 head cam uh, to what you're on right now, which is like a window mount. All right, guys. All right, got y'all on the virtual head cam here. Make sure y'all can see everything well. Looking down the road. All right. So I noticed the temperature gauge was coming up and then it just dropped back down. So we got a faulty temp gauge here. Um, it's not working. The motor's staying cool. I mean, it was showing about uh, halfway up before it dropped. And then I noticed it was just all the way back down. So might need to get another gauge put in. That way you know 100%. You can hear the wind is rattling in the doors. That's what that noise is. Ooh, a little tire spin. Coming up on the road right now, it's got a decent sized speed bump in it. Kind of feel the suspension. The suspension in this one's nice, so you're not gonna have any issues uh, with getting bounced around or anything, but you can listen for rattles. I think mainly you're gonna hear the windows. It's coming up right here. Right here. Didn't even hear the windows that time. Not really any rattles in this one. We've made it back around. We're gonna go ahead and pull back into the lot and conclude this video. Definitely check out, or out the walk around, point out any kind of flaws on the outside. That way you know everything about this car. I appreciate y'all riding along with me. All right, guys, thanks again for riding along with me. If you have any other questions, definitely visit maplemotors.com. You get financing options, shipping options. Uh, see all of our inventory, wheels, tires, parts, accessories are also available on that site. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I post videos every single day, and I'll continue to do so. 
That way you know everything about these cars before you travel across the U.S. to come pick them up. I appreciate y'all watching. Thanks again, guys.